actually agree that the rise of the far right in Germany is possibly less troubling than in other parts of Europe. It is an issue in some cities, in some regions. To me, the most troubling issue when it comes to Germany and Germany within the EU is that Germany has not been able to stand up to its natural role as leader of the EU. We have seen it we have seen this in the in the aftermath of the 2008-2009 economic crisis, an obsession for inflation, austerity during the Greek crisis. So I think that the reunification has created a superior power within the EU, a leader, possibly a hegemon, who is unable to fulfill its role and its mission. I, I think you're right, but perhaps that will be a generational thing that once we have you know, Angela Merkel shuffles away as she seems to be on her way to doing and we have a new younger chancellor who doesn't feel as though they're so so much constrained by the history of Germany not just the history of division but also the Nazi division um, but I agree with you it's not really so much of a danger in Germany the rise of the far right because when you sort of balance it all out you look at the rise of the Greens as well they're having enormous success in Germany and there's a whole new generation that's coming along and I, th I think it's unfair on Germany when you look at the the strides it has made particularly since the end of the Second World War to say it's at risk of going down a nasty path because it's a very stable country.